Skano Ani, welcome to another session of Res Blues. I'm Diane Kahoko, your host. These sessions are made possible by the Canada Council for the Performing Arts in partnership with Elaine Bombery, the Toronto Blues Society, Indigenous Performing Arts Alliance, and CKRZ 100.3 FM, the Voice of the Grand. Res Blues is celebrating 25 years of Indigenous Blues. No matter where you travel on Turtle Island, you will always find Res Blues. Tonight, we take you to the West Coast and the music of George Leach. Born in British Columbia, George undertakes many creative avenues, including actor, composer, performer, and even the creator of beautiful pottery. In 2013, George won three Aboriginal People's Choice Awards for Songwriter of the Year, Best Rock Album for Surrender, and Single of the Year for Carry Me. 2014, he was nominated for Juno for Aboriginal Album of the Year. George Leach is a man on the mission with these live performances and high energy. So please help me welcome to Res Blues, George Leach. <coughs> Back in the corner. <coughs> Yeah. 
prayer song. <laughs> Thank you. 
Standing here at the crossroads, and watching you go down the road. <laughs> All right, just gonna get right into it. Mm.
George, Nyawa, and thank you for sharing your amazing talent with us tonight. Well, this concludes my hosting duties for Res Blues. I have been thrilled to host three sessions. It was so much fun, and the talent of our Indigenous musicians is mind-blowing, and I'm very proud of them all. I also want to take this time and thank Elaine Bombery for asking me to be a part of this amazing music series. I also thank Derek Andrews and Huma of the Toronto Blues Society. Thank you for your work in promoting blues for 35 years. Tune in next Friday night at 8 p.m. for the conclusion of Res Blues when Elaine Bombery will be your host and Josh Miller and the Pappy Johns Band will be the musical guests. Good night and stay safe.